Hello, beautiful people, and welcome to Hafiz TV. And thanks for joining us at this hour. My name is Abdullah Shamoun Bako, and today we will be talking about Islamic Personality Awards that is coming off on the 2nd November 2023 at the National Theatre here in Accra. There's going to be a lot more coming as far as the Islamic Personality Awards is concerned. So come with me, and so we'll interview the real people behind this award scheme. Hafiz TV, unique every day. So I'm going to allow them to introduce themselves and then the conversation begins. So to my left, uh, if you could tell us your name. My name is uh, Mohamed Ali, the coordinator of uh, Islamic Personality Award 2023. And of course, to our beautiful sister. And my name is Aisha Tukuma. The Spiritual Secretary of Islamic Personality Awards. All right. As you can see, they have you to know more about this award. So let me begin with my sister. Uh, um, uh, tell us something about the Islamic Personality Award. What should we anticipate as far as this event is concerned? Islamic Personality Award is, uh, is created to inspire the Muslim community and also to inspire the upcoming in the Zengo community to be greater for themselves and to become a, a, a better person in life. So this Islamic Personality Award is, is created to inspire the community so De definitely it's good you mentioned it it's it, it, to inspire the community of course yeah. uh, uh the muslim community yeah. needed something like this to ride on and be able to also better themselves up so um tell us how is the preparation towards that was we understand we're about the, uh, two weeks to go uh, what have you been doing and 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 tell us more the category and then voting the non-voting tell us more about that one. basically the award that mm -hmm. is on the 2nd of November, it will fall on a Thursday night. Uh, basically, we were able to put ourselves together. As we said, the award, we have two categories. We have the voting category and then the non-voting category. The non-voting category basically is about merit. Okay. There are some people in the community that we want to empower, we want to award on that night. And those kind of people cannot be put in uh, in, 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 a, voting. in a voting category. Exactly. Basically. So we have a citation for them to honor them in our community. So when you look at the, the voting category, we have about about 40 uh, awards that we are going to give on that, that, on that, on that, on that night. Day. And when you look at the categories, we have something like uh, Miss Muhijab, Miss Muhijab of the year, female personality of the year, female personality, male personality of, the year, of the year, male personality of the year, uh, media personality of the year, many, many, best, I guess. best Quran reciter uh, the of the year. So in the category has a lot of people put together. So uh, I will entreat each and everyone to come out and then support this cause because this is the opportunity for us as Muslim Ummah to also recognize our heroes in our communities. So we put this house together to celebrate our own definitely basically. definitely well, well said uh, mr ali and let me come back to my sister um so what should people expect on that day that night what is the expectation um give us a gist of what we, we, we're going to expect <laughs> and, and, and tell us more well the people should expect the best wow yes because what we are going to expect that night is going to like they should come and witness themselves. I can't say all, oh, but it's going to be wonderful that night. Mm -hmm. It's going to be inspiring, educative, mm -hmm. and fun. And fun. But, Talking yeah. about fun, I, I, mm -hmm. I understand there's going to be a red carpet where yes, people okay. are going to be interviewed yeah. based on what they wear and, and you know, to, yes. to familiarize themselves yes. with the people and all yes. of that. And then the main event starts. Yes. And, and, yeah, so, and there's going to be some souvenirs and some giveaways that yes. will be given to yeah. some people who. Yes, there will be. I sent uh, I I think think yeah. yeah, definitely. From one of our potential sponsors. Mm. Yeah, so there will be um we we'll give out something like Quran, 
Okay. Yeah, so people should and some, some yeah, drinks uh, yes, and some lot. other things. So, so, so what time should people come? You know, we we were talking about uh, um, uh, Ghana time and, and yeah. people not showing up to events as early as possible. The event, I understand, is going to start as early as 7. Yeah. So what time should people come? Okay, sh uh, people should be there around 6.30 mm. because we are going to work with time. Mm. This one, 7 p.m. is 7 p.m. And because the National Theatre is going to take about 1,400, if you don't come on time, you will not have a place to sit. So you have to come on time to get a place to feel comfortable. Yeah, so 6.30 to 7, everything starts. Before we do go, let, let's talk about celebrating each other. Let's, let's talk about, uh, you know, uh, um, 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 coming together to do something that has to benefit the Ummah. Um, oftentimes we see that our own people are not supportive of one another. What, what would you say to that uh, yes, in the uh, lead up to this event? Uh, uh, actually, when you look at our society, hmm. when you look at the, the Ghana as a whole, you have so many other awards celebrating people. But in our Muslim community, it's, it's very difficult to see such awards that promote and then encourage our people. So basically, Islamic Personality Awards is, is just an award that will, will complement what people do in our societies, will encourage our people what they do. Because when you look at every aspect of life, mm. we Muslims are they, they at the forefront. Exactly. We have good doctors, we have lawyers, we have engineers, we have media men all over. But our Islamic uh, uh, environment don't have those kind of skin to recognize them. So this one comes in handy to celebrate our people, to make sure that we encourage our people to be doing more of what the society expected us to do. So uh, we would like to invite everybody to come on board to support this scheme. You can see it's a nationwide scheme, a scheme that recognizes the whole Muslim Ummah. We have nominees from Accra, from Kumasi, from Tamale, all over Ghana. So it's not an award that People will say it's based in people in Accra. It's mm. all over. It's all over. So Ghana. each and everyone should come and then support. And it's a free event, actually. It's a free event. And we have sponsors that are coming on board who are going to give us souvenirs. And there is also I think 13 on Dine Night. And the, the program starts at 7 p.m., right? Cup at 7 p.m. to 8 p.m. And then the actual event starts at 8 o'clock and then end around 11. So as we encourage each and everyone to come to the program, make sure you should be conscious of time because we are not going to play with our time. If it's seven, it's seven o'clock. Basically, that is what we have for for our people. Well said, Mr. Ali. Would you like to add another? Would you, would you, your last words, basically? Yes, what I would like to add is to thank our potential sponsors mm. for a great job done. Mm. So I'd like to say a big thank you to you. Mm. Accra Newtown Islamic Hospital, mm. Central Immigration Grace Travel and Tour, Maison Rizzi Frangrat, mm. Alfred Dice Bites mm. Restaurant, and Alcodes. And Alcodes. Thank you very I much. I also see my opportunity to also thank our media partners. Mm. We have a lot of them on board, mm. like we have the UTV, we have TV Africa, we have Hafiz TV, Maraba we have FM. Maraba FM, we have Gaskia TV, Baina TV, all these Madis CTV, FM, Madis, Madis TV. FM. They are all here to also support the cause. So uh, basically, we also like to entreat each and everyone to come out in your numbers to support this cause. This is a, a, a something for the Dean. We are inviting everybody to come on board. This one is an Islamic event. And when we say Islamic, it's Islamic event. You dress well and then come and then enjoy this event. It will be a very great night with a lot of excitement. <laughs> Definitely, it will be a great night with a lot of excitement. And that's why we're calling all of you to come to the National Theatre on the 2nd of November and for all of us to come together and celebrate our heroes and our heroines and change makers. My name is Abdel Shamon Bako. Uh, can cut to see the Palacina Embassy. We're here at the premises, of course, on a auspicious day that we call on free Palestine. We call on the end of the occupation of the Palestinian people. We want people, we need to support each other. Thank you. My name is Shamun Bako. Wassalamu alaikum.
You ask for it and we listen. Your request has been heard and acted upon. The maiden edition of Islamic Personality Award is finally here. Now, join us as we celebrate the heroes of our time, the change makers, happening live on 2nd November 2023 at the National Theatre Accra. Come and witness the anxiety, the beautiful drama, and the race for the ultimate prize. Who wins what? Who gets crowned? Join us as we congratulate our champions. I will be there. You should be there too. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Celebrating under the team, a partnership and building an auspicious future, the role of the Muslim. For inquiries, contact these following numbers 050-3022-994-0262-570-481. IPA 2023. Brought to you by Halal Incorporation. Sponsored by... Media Partners. Hafiz TV, unique every day.